Good morning, good morning. What's up, what's up? Just pull y'all up. We are going to do the dragon kits this morning. So I've been making petals since like 6.30 this morning, y'all. Lord have mercy. Uh, we are going to do both of them today. The black one and the green one. Um, I do have more dragon kits coming. Um, so just be patient and they will be here. Hello, hello. Good morning. What's up, what's up, y'all? All right, so we are getting comments. Um, everything is going good so far. I can't do that. So if you see me, I got my new glasses, and I absolutely love them. The only problem I'm having is when I have turned my head sideways, the whole table and room tilt. So if you see me kind of grab the table, or kind of readjust. Just know I hadn't been drinking this morning. I'm just still trying to adjust to my new glasses, okay? <laughs> so we are doing the green dragon kit and the black dragon kit. Um, first, we are gonna get the faces ready. Um, you gotta leave for the doctor. What? I'll, I'll try. I'll get as much done as I can in 15 minutes. It will take some time. Oh my gosh. I I love being able to read the distance and I can still read my comments on the computer, y'all. Because y'all see me all the time. I'm like getting real close trying to see them. But I can see everything now. I almost wish I had done it a lot sooner. <laughs> so let me bring you down and... We will get these masks ready to go. Um, so, the black kit, the black dragon, comes with the purple eyes and the purple and black mesh. The green dragon comes with the red eyes. And if you can see it back here, the green and black mesh. Um, so, let me show you what we're going to do. I am going to go ahead and take a zip tie. It's on the way. And what we're going to do is take a zip tie, and I am running it right around the stretchy and where it attaches. That way, when we attach it to the board, it can't slip because it still has to go past another zip tie, right? So that's what I'm doing. Okay, just like that. Get these cut off. And then we can cut this off because we don't need it, okay? You can get these masks from Amazon. Now, I found it easier. We kind of struggled with the eyes when I did the others, right? So, I actually found it easier to get. Now, this is the only thing you don't get in your kit, okay? Um, but you can grab any black felt, um, black foam, whatever you have that's black. Or you don't need to add it at all. Totally up to you. But I found it easier to go ahead and attach the eyes to the felt. And then we will glue the felt to the mask. Okay. So I'm going to go ahead and line up my eyes. On the felt. Making sure they're straight up and down. Yay, Lisa. Do I get my commission check? 
Do you need my address? <laughs> okay, just like that. And just kind of hold it in place. Good morning. <sighs> Should I not have asked that, Pam? <laughs> Dana. Dana, girl. <laughs> All right. Let's let those sit for a minute. We will go ahead and do the purple ones because I did the purple ones yesterday. So the purple ones come with the black dragon. So now all we have to do is glue it right to the mask. Okay, now we'll have a couple minutes to adjust. But see how much easier that is, y'all? So I'm just going to hold it, make sure it sits. I'll do the same thing to the other side. I know, I'm so smart. How big is that? I don't know. I didn't measure. Um, it's about three inches, three by two. Three inches by two inches. much easier y'all see how easy that was oh it's so spooky now just the mask when I bought these they actually have holes in the nostril if you don't want to see that give a little more glue under here then take another piece of felt and glue it right around the nostril. But see, that is so much easier than trying to glue the eyes and then glue the felt and yeah. All right, so I cut a little piece and we're gonna fit it right around his nostril just because I don't want to be able to see through it. Okay, just like that. Let me hold those for just a second. These are the 25 millimeter that come in the kits, yes. You can always get a 30 or a 35 if you want. The eyes do come with this kit, but if you're ordering um, the kit off of, or the costume off of Amazon, you have to order the eyes separately. Okay. He's ready to be put on, y'all. Easy peasy. So let's put him off to the side so we can let that glue set. Let's do these red eyes. And then we can 
start working on the wreath. You still have a couple seconds to work with it. You're welcome. You have an order for another one? Yay! Chris is added to play it. Okay, we're gonna do the same thing to this nostril. On my other ones, the nostrils were solid, but just the mask, we had a hole. If you have these big clips, it will help hold that in place. I try to make it easy for y'all. I really do. I want y'all to succeed. And if I can find an easier way to do it, then I'm totally going to do that. Because look, I need an easy life too. Right? <laughs> but not on the iPad, huh? These will be available, the finished ones will be available on my website once I get pictures. And then once it's set, you can take that clip off, walk away call it a day. All right, let's set those. Should have held it just a little bit longer, y'all. That's gonna, let me just hold it before we move on. I love it with the red eyes. What do y'all think? I got an email. Why did you put red eyes with him? I'm like, because it's cool. <laughs> no, the kit only comes with a mask because, y'all, that the whole costume is expensive. Um, so I've got to worry about prices as well when I do these kits. Nobody's going to buy a $100 kit. I'm just, I'm exaggerating there. Um, but you would imagine I would have to add another 10 to $15 on top of what the kit was already going for. So um, there's just no way. So let's do these red petals. Now, as you can see, we are doing these a little bit different than what the other one and the ones I've been doing. Um, so, and shipping would be more expensive. Absolutely. Um, so let me show you. Now the purple petal is the same one we have been doing. Okay, so it's 10 by 10. Diamond shape, we're gonna bring the top to the bottom. Now I think this one was actually 10 and a half, but you can still cut it at 10 inches. It's not gonna hurt a thing. See, now my table's wobbling. So let me focus. Um, 
and then hold your hand. We're going to bring right to left. If you're left-handed, you'll bring, I'm sorry, we're bringing left to right. If you're left-handed, you bring right to left, okay? So we're going to bring and line up these two sides. Turn it sideways. I got pretty far. <laughs> For a friend. Yay. And then we're going to bring the bottom to the top, lining up these tips. Okay, just like that. And I'm taking my finger, running it right inside, stretching it. I'm bringing this to a point as much as possible. Pinching that end. And then we're just going to band it, okay? Just like that. And then you can keep playing with it if you need to, okay? So there's the purple petal. The black one, it's still, it's still the Star Trek petal. Um, this is fabric mesh, okay? Um, so it's still 10 by 10, curl side up, diamond shape, we're gonna bring top to the bottom. Still lining up our edges. Okay, still bringing left to right. And then here's where it gets just a little bit different, okay? The way we do the purple one kind of gives it that natural curve. Can y'all see that? But I don't want the natural curve on that black. So what I'm doing is I'm taking my left hand and I'm holding the top of this down and I'm going to take my two fingers here and here and we're going to stretch it. We're going to stretch it and bring it together just like that and then pinch it. So it's still the same petal um, just done a little bit differently. Okay. but it doesn't give us that natural curve that this one does. Everybody with me? And then this one is gonna sit like this. Okay, so let's go ahead and I'm gonna show y'all how to load this board. I still get tons of questions on how to load the board. Um, so let's get these this done and then we can play y'all we can play so for this one we are loading the outside to that first hole and then the two interconnected okay so we're going from the outside to that first hole and you can go ahead and zip it up now the flat end of the zip tie is facing to the ceiling, okay? For this one, we're gonna go in this hole and up this one. And then when we come back in and do the black pedal, we're gonna go here to here, okay? So flat end of the zip tie facing up. Zip it two inside sets of holes. Hello, hello. So one more time, flat end to the ceiling of that first hole to the outside of the board, and then the inner two holes. And then I add that middle hole, that middle zip tie when we add the black pedal, okay? All right, we got the prep done. Now let's have some fun. So we're doing the purples. 
So once you get them done, you can just put them right in the board. I am doing it where the curve is going to the inside. Let me just get some purple petals up here. Do you see how many petals I had to make this morning? Lord, have mercy. Hello, hello. Okay, so we're doing the two purple. And then we're going to come in with the other zip tie. And we're going from here to here. And it's easier just to leave this one open. And then instead of doing it this way, we have our curve and our hole facing up. And I'm lining that zip tie right over that black elastic band, okay? And then just fix that petal, rotate it around. And I'm not going to worry about our petals so much right now. We will get them all adjusted once I get everything on. But isn't that cool? Too cool for school, man. So it's just another look. for our dragon. Yes, more dragon kits are on the way. I have more of the purple, or oh, I'm sorry, I have more of the black and the green, and I have a purple one coming. I think it's purple. Yeah, man. So who went to Hobby Lobby? Oh, wrong pedal. Do your Hobby Lobbies have the boards? Monk hasn't decided yet. He wants me to do the red. Oh, the red dragon. I do have the red dragon coming too. Um, he wants me to do the red one. And then he'll decide which one he wants. Johnny called the green one. You bought two? Yeah, I bought two as well. Not that I needed them, but I was like, look, I gotta support my girl, right? So I bought two. I may not even use them. I may just leave them right where they are. I'll hang them on my wall. <laughs> where did I buy these kits? At monkeyscreations.com. Or if you're looking for the costumes, you can get them at Amazon. Oh, I forgot to cut those off, y'all. Yeah. See, I got so excited. Now I'm not going to mess with my petals anymore until we get them all done. Good morning, good morning. You want to do the white one, but the, oh. The white one um, was sold out. I couldn't get the white one, but I tried.
So yeah, I have the red as well. So red, purple, black, and green are all coming. Good morning. Yeah. Well, the thing is, if we buy them, then they have to keep supplying them, right? And then hopefully they'll order the other boards. So if we show up and buy them all, then we'll get the other ones. That's the plan, Stan. and demand exactly so even though I didn't need any I still bought two See that ants I posted? <laughs> it's coming. They are $5.99 at Hobby Lobby. So just a few cents more. Not bad at all. And they had um, the sunflower sunnas. I think they were three ninety nine or three ninety nine or four ninety nine. But I think they were three ninety nine. Making these wreaths is just like eating Thanksgiving dinner. It takes so long to prepare, and then it takes you like 15 minutes to, to eat it. <laughs> right? <laughs> Jacksonville, Florida. Yeah, go see if they have them. Take a picture. The Hobby Lobby is in store only, y'all. Not online, unfortunately. Today, today's Tuesday. 
thought mine when you said something about getting a picture. Oh, you did. I really need to turn that glue gun off because I feel like I'm going to lay my hand right on it. And that would be just my luck. Good morning. Oh, I forgot my water, y'all. Twenty three skids of oh, my God. They gonna be busy, y'all. Christmas in July is coming. <laughs> when did they start showing commercials? Doing? I've had commercials for almost since they they came out with it, but I do. With all that ad money, with all that ad money, like literally, I think it's like $40, um, if that, I donate it to our local animal shelter. So, just watch them and think of the dogs I help. <laughs> How about that? <laughs> So all my star money and my ad money goes to our local animal shelter. Really? I get ads all the time when I watch lives. Not that I watch a lot, but when I do... I see ads all the time. It's looking funky, isn't it? I promise. We'll bring it together. Yeah, I see ads all the time too. No, it's 16, 16, and 16. This is the ring board, not the oval. So the ring board, you have 16. The oval, you have 20. And took them. Oh, that's awesome. a pit bull rescue one of my son's friends left his dog here dogs here which he thought was just gonna be a couple days <laughs> and it's been weeks and they are the nicest pit bulls they're amazing dogs 
but my dogs do not like them. Even though the pit bulls just want to play with my dogs, my dogs are not having anything to do with them. So I need to find a pit bull rescue. Where did I get the petal template for the flower? Which, I don't know which one you're talking about, your friend? But I know I can't take them to a regular shelter because they'll just put them down and I don't want that. All right, I'm gonna cut, since we're working underneath now, I'm gonna cut the tips of these off just a little bit so we don't have to fight. Okay, so we're just gonna gently lift these up. Tuck them in. last black petal in. I thought I had left one more, but y'all know I don't know how to count. <laughs> Let me cut the tip of that off. Your shelter's bag for them? Oh, the blankets. You did the first dragon you used a petal I used mesh I used the same petal right here on that first dragon okay so let's figure out how we want our petals we're just gonna move them around goes there. Now when I hang this up, I'll be able to tell more. What it looks like. But for now, all I can see is like overhead. <laughs> Look how cool that is. I thought these would lay down a little bit more. But what I can always do is lay it upside down for a little bit. And it will lay a little bit flatter for us. Okay, but I'm not going to worry about it right now. But if you lay it flat down, then they'll start to lay a little bit flatter. Does that make sense? I think it's 
freaking cool. All right, let's finish our green one. So this one is done the exact same way we have we have done all of the others. So we're going to make the green one. One, two, three, four. Yes. All right. Ten by ten. Curl side up. Diamond shape. Bring top to the bottom. Line up your edges. Okay, we're gonna bring left to right, lining this tip with this tip. Just like that, turn it sideways. And then I'm gonna bring bottom to the top, aligning these tips up. Okay, and I'm gonna go right inside and we're just gonna elongate and give that petal an extra curve. And then pinch it and band it. Okay, so there's our petal. Now for the black, still 10 by 10, top to the bottom. Line it up. We're going to bring this tip this way. Just keeping these lined up as best you can. That part does not need to be perfect. What I'm concerned about is this tip up here. So I'm going to lay my finger down there. Keep that as flat as possible. Fold this one down. Okay. Turn it sideways, scrunch, and band it. Okay, so those are the two petals, and then we turn it upside down for this black. So those are the two petals on this one. Okay, so the layout is exactly the same. Adding our third zip tie for the black. Now the seams I'm doing face down. We're now working on that last petal right up underneath. Thanks. And doing it this way actually makes them shippable, y'all.
All right, let's get this one somewhat organized here. And came back. <laughs> I was. I finished that one. So we wanted to finish the green. Get all the green on for this kit. And then we can put our dragon mask on. And call this one a wrap. Okay. So two different ways to do them. It's just green fabric mesh. All right, since we have the green already up here, whew, I really need my water. Let's grab the green one. If you missed how we did this, go back and watch the beginning um, because um, I showed you an easier way to do the eyes, okay? That'll teach you to walk away. <laughs> so I'm finding the top of my board, even though it really does not matter. Um, so the top of the board is considered right here where your two holes are. So you can put these either right in the middle or off to the side. Totally up to you. I will do it both ways. Um, I'll put one off to the side and I'll put one at the top so that you can um, see what it looks like. And for the one at the side, okay, so right here is our middle, which means this is our middle. So I'm going to put them right here, okay? So I'm going to work with it from underneath. So I'm going to go right here. So the outside I just think it'll be easier to show y'all this way. Let's go ahead and get that closed. I'm actually thinking maybe it's going to be easier just to use the pipe cleaners. Okay, so I'm going to wrap it around. Yeah, and then we'll just go from here to here. Okay, I'm just going to do it loosely for now. Do the same thing on this side. See how I'm stretching it and I'm going above that zip tie? Okay, 
yeah cute for Christmas for sure okay do the same thing here going up under that petal and we'll just go from that first hole to the outside <coughs> I'm just doing it loosely. Oh, I totally did that on the wrong side. <laughs> but I think it still looks cool. It'll be fine. No, it won't. It should have been on this side. <laughs> oh my goodness. See, only me. be all right. I forgot I was working upside down. But it would go either side. Okay. Let's try this again. And here. Actually, I think it really needs to go up. One more. Normally, I've put mine right here, so I haven't. So let's go up one and see if that looks better. So it'll go. Yeah, I like that more. So we're going one up from middle. in and then I will turn it over and show you again what I did Okay, so right here's the top of your board. So, well, I went up too. Lord, y'all, I'm losing my mind. But that's okay, I like it. Okay, so here's middle, here's middle. So I went up one, two. Okay, so from your middle section down two, and from this middle up two. It looks backwards to you? What? Now, if you wanted to add um, your flames, then all you have to do is let me see if I've got a, I've got a scrap piece of mesh. Let's do it with this green. You agree it looks backwards? What are y'all talking about? Um, just take one section and put another zip tie, and then just grab you a ten by ten like yellow um yes i think the scale should go up the other way well, i like it like this <laughs> um yellow red and orange mesh and actually i would go like this bring your insides in and then scrunch
and bring your petals down like that. Or you can do the rolled method and then zip tie it right onto your board and you can have the flame shooting out. Okay, so there's your green one. Let's finish the purple one. All right, so there's our purple. And we're gonna put this one head on. Okay, so right here's our top. So we're gonna put one on each side. Just like that. What are y'all talking about? Do it any way you want. <laughs> All right, so we're going to do this one the same way. except we're going on each side of the middle, okay? And I think I'm gonna use the bottom, okay? So we're gonna go from here to here and here to here. Now, if you want to put yours up higher, you most definitely can. Totally up to you. <clears throat> now, it's not giving the mask enough to sit on, though. So let's go up. Let's go up one. Turn it over and let y'all see where I put it.
sitting. All right, so middle, and then I use the bottom and the top. Okay. Kind of looks lopsided. Let's see if I can get it fixed. It's hard to see when it's not. Oh, it looks fine that way. But I'll get all of his stuff fixed once I get them hung up. Hung up. So there is your purple dragon kit. We'll get it all situated. I keep seeing things that need fixed. And there is your green one. All right. Um, these kids don't have wings. You can watch my other one, my other two videos to see how I attach those wings. Um, but these kits do not have wings. All right, I am out of here. Y'all have an awesome day. Um, the Dragon Kits will be back in stock soon, hopefully within the next few days. Um, and that's all I got. VIP. Today's Tuesday. Is Dre live with y'all tonight? I don't remember. Maybe. All right. That's all I've got. Um, Y'all have an amazing day, and I will turn my head more slowly, holy cow, and I'll see y'all probably tomorrow, um, and we will do, we'll do something, I don't know, I don't know. Y'all have an awesome day, bye y'all.